Stewart Defenders, Hastings Broncos, in a top 25 GPAC matchup at Lynn Fair Arena on Glow Night. And the Broncos came out playing hard in front of a rowdy student section on Glow Night. Here's a boo fall early in the first half off the Loman feed. Then Loman with the smooth Euro step for two. The G Pack's top team, though, shot the ball well with most of their offense coming from Austin Kache with the three here. The Broncos would not lead in the first half. Second half now. Despite trailing by 10 at the half, the Broncos continued to work into the deficit. Here's Brett Wells in the corner. Brady Loman had a great second half as well. Pulls up here for two. Then off the Tobin Ridewald steal. And the foul, he would make the free throw. Then he grabs the rebound himself. And the finish, game high 26 points for Loman. Then he shows some defense here, forcing the bad pass. And Wells finishes on the opposite end, he had 10. The Broncos continuing to chip into the deficit. Dort continued to score the ball well behind Kache. Then a real nice play by Brandon Krause here off the Bloom rebound. He finishes in traffic and the foul, he would make the free throw. A lot of clutch shots down the stretch for the Broncos as they fought to keep it close. Krause with a big three from the corner, 14 for him. Now with the shot clock off, just 16.6 left in the game, Broncos are down five. Rebound goes to Lena, up ahead to Bloom. Loman with the huge three to make it a two point game and the Broncos still in it. Now with the game up for grabs, it's Kyle Lindenberg at the line. Controversial play here as it appears as though Dort's Tyler Wolterstroff touches the ball, although it's tough to tell from this angle. Dort though would get the break and retain possession, essentially ending the game as Kate seals it with a pair of free throws. The Broncos dropped their sixth game of the season, falling to 17-6 in a hard-fought loss, 78-74.